Hey guys, this is Grant from Bowhunter247, and today I'm going to be doing a review of Nocturnal Lighted Nox. Um, as you saw there, I'm shooting green Nocturnals. I think they're only supposed to weigh about 20 grains, so they don't really affect your arrow flight that much. Um, I'm just going to show you guys how they work, and I'm going to shoot them for you right now too. So, basically, um, I just have my block target set out at about 30 yards. You guys probably can't see it in the video because I can barely see it myself, but uh, I'm going to turn my sight light on here on my True Glow, True Sight Extreme. And I'm just going to put the pin somewhere on the target just so that I uh, don't miss. And hopefully you guys will be able to see this green nocturnal fly straight into the target. So here we go. Okay guys, so uh, as you can see right down there, right below the uh, that light that's across the field, you can see the little green light. That's my nocturnal, shot it at 30 yards, um, sticking in the target right now. Um, probably a lot brighter to me than it is to you guys, just because I'm filming this with my iPod, so it's only like 720p, I'm pretty sure. Um, but now I'm just going to... Go grab that arrow, bring it up here, and show you guys how to shut these things off. Okay, guys, so here's the nocturnal after I ran and retrieved my arrow. So all you have to do to shut these off, um, I like these a lot more than uh, the uh, Luminox because they're a lot easier to shut off and it doesn't affect the alignment of the knock. Um, the tracers, they have the magnet, so they're super easy to shut off, but... Um, that magnet can just kind of be a hassle for other things, but so you can't really see it in the video. But basically, I'll explain it to you guys on the bro, on the knock. It has the two main sides, and one of them has a hole in it, and there's the little light, and then there's a little piece of metal. And you stick your paper clip right underneath the little green light. I know you guys can't really see it because the light's too bright, and you just push up. Well, that happens a lot because these knocks don't really stay very tight into my arrow, so I'll just take it just to knock. Try this again. You stick it under the green thing. I know you guys probably can't see this, but I'm just trying to explain it. And it just went off like that, so maybe now you guys can see it. The little hole. Um is right here where the end of my paper clip is and you can see the green light and you can also see the little piece of metal in there and you just stick the paper clip or pin or whatever right in between those two and you push up on the green and that shuts it off for you so um thanks for watching my review on nocturnal lighted knocks hopefully this will help you guys out because i know there's uh quite a few types of lighted knocks out there now I know Carbon Express made some now, so that gives you quite a few options. But in my opinion, I think that these nocturnals are the best. They're supposed to last over 20 hours. Um, I read a review about a guy that had his last a couple days so that he could find his arrow. But uh, they're great. They don't really affect your arrow flight that much. So hopefully you guys will pick some of these up yourself if you're looking into getting some lighted knocks. But... Um, other than that, just thanks for watching my review on the Nocturnal Lighted Knocks.